Hello everyone, welcome to Cracksoid. Today I am thrilled to announce that the latest bootleggers ROM is back and it's better than ever with latest Mars 5 2023 security update. Bootleggers ROM is known for its impressive features and unique customizations and it also provides a smooth and stable user experience, making it a popular choice among Android lovers. In this video, I'll be sharing my experiences with the latest bootleggers ROM. So without further ado, let's explore what their ROM has to offer. As you can see, this ROM is running on latest Android version 13. And this is bootlegger 7.1 stable ROM with the build date of April 9, 2023 and has android security update of mars 5 2023 and if you look at the kernel quicksilver kernel is used in this rom i have installed this rom on redmi note 8 and this is an unofficial version of the bootleggers rom camera let's kick off with the camera this rom provides miui camera which also have working 48 megapixel camera and portrait mode and everything inside this camera is working properly including night light panorama etc user experience when it comes to user experience the bootleggers roam offers a clean and smooth experience with a minimal pre-installed apps you get a clutter free interface and as i navigate through the system i can see that the roam is quite responsive and i'm not experiencing any lags or slowdowns while swiping and scrolling on the screen this may vary depending on the device you are using but overall the performance is quite impressive Additionally, you can see the app opening and closing speed of this room. Tell me in the comments how's the app opening and closing speed that this room provides. Google Photo Stories one of the most wanted feature in custom rooms is Google Photos Unlimited Stories and I am happy to announce that this room comes with this unlimited photos and video stories feature on Google Photos app. This means that you can back up all of your photos and videos without worrying about running out of stories. Antutu Benchmark Score Moving towards Antutu Benchmark, I'll directly show the scores as I have already run this test and as you can also see the Antutu Benchmark score of this ROM is 204121, which is a pretty good score because in my recent ultimate performance comparison video between C-Adroid and Evolution Axe, C-Adroid has scored 203877 and Evolution has scored 202921. Geekpain 6 score now moving towards Geekbench 6 test results, as you can see the score for single core is 324 and the score for multi core is 1185 which I again consider a better score for this device. And you can see the Geekbench 6 score of CRDroid and Evolution X ROM on the screen too. CPU throttling test results. Now after Antutu and Geekbench test results, I'll show the result of CPU throttling test which I have conducted for 15 minutes straight and as you can see after doing test for straight 15 minutes, CPU has throttled to 93% of its maximum performance and the average score is 136182 GIPS which I consider an average score. Safety net status now moving towards safety net test, as you can see it has passed the safety net compatibility test and also on play protect certification on Google Play Store app, device is certified. Dolby Atmos Let's talk about the Dolby Atmos feature that comes with bootleggers room. For those who are not familiar with Dolby Atmos, it's a surround sound technology that gives you a more immersive audio experience. With bootleggers room, you can enjoy this feature right out of the box. And I'm happy to report that the Dolby Atmos feature works seamlessly on this room, providing crisp and clear audio that really enhances the overall experience. And you can enable this feature right from the app section and also from QS style section. Launcher Talking about launcher, this room comes with quick step launcher and from its launcher home setting, you can do some customizations on home screen, app drawer, recents and on miscellaneous. And from miscellaneous, you can enable and use parallel space feature which will make a clone of your existing app. And from its recent settings, you can enable this memory info, so remaining RAM available on recent app section. And if you look closely, you will find screenshot quick action button there, although lens and clear all buttons are enabled, but they are not appearing on recent app section. And that's the bug that we get in this room. Also from recent app sections, you can get some options like app info, kill, split top, uninstall and freeform. 
private DNS. Now let's explore the settings and customizations available in its settings section. At first there is network and internet where you'll find private DNS option and the good thing is that it comes with five different custom DNS providers. Bootleg dumpster. Below you'll find bootleg dumpster settings from where you can do some customizations on different section of your phone like on status bar, quick settings, notifications, lock screen, animations, power menu, buttons and miscellaneous where you will get two sections. First one is app related tweaks where pre-apps volume control feature is available and system features where you can find some theming related customization along with smart pixel and ignore window secure flag option. Battery. Now moving towards battery setting, you will get some options like battery uses, battery saver, battery manager, battery percentage and some battery overlays which you can also see on the screen. App lock. In its security setting, you will find app lock features inside more security settings and to use it, we need to set screen lock at first. Xiaomi parts. In this bootlegger's room, you will also get Xiaomi parts option where you will get settings like MI sound enhancer, clear speaker, display color calibration and more. Gestures. And from system setting, you will get gesture options from where you can choose between gesture, two button and three button navigation option. Also our favorite feature swipe to screenshot is also present and when you take screenshot you can share, edit and delete it but search lens option is not present here. So this is all about the unofficial and latest bootlegger 7.1 room. So what do you think about this room? You can share your thoughts and experience related to this room on comment section below. And if you're a fan of bootlegger's room then you should definitely try this latest Android 13 based bootlegger's room which also provides stable and smooth user experience with great performance so thank you so much for watching this video and if you like our video then don't forget to hit the like button comment down below share this video and subscribe to cracks also hit the notification bell i'll see you in my next video bye